Hello. Hello. Hi. Hi. Uh, it's us again. We're going to see another movie. Yes, I know we have not posted a bunch of reviews, and we have actually seen a bunch of movies, but... A couple of Oscar nominees now. Oh, a couple of Oscar nominees now, but there were audio isho issues. I'm getting it figured out. We'll figure it out. Uh, Oscars. The Oscars got announced. Uh, the nominees. I am bummed that Florida Project didn't get nominated for more. I think... Yes. It should have gotten nominated for a lot more. It should have gotten nominated for a lot more. Probably. Ah. Uh, probably. <laughs> uh, pro Can't prob get so excited when people show up. I, I like he's, he's one of my favorites. So. Okay, good. He's, he's my boy. Then you can get excited. Mm. Anyways, uh, so I wanted it to get a nom for Best Picture because it's good marketing and Sean Baker seems like a sweet guy. At he least when I heard him on do, an interview, so... He doesn't want to do big budget movies, but still, it would have been nice for him. I feel like he will have one eventually, maybe. Yeah, I mean, I feel like he's going there. I haven't seen Tangerine, which, yes, I know you want me to see, so hopefully that... I was kind we of... We should have done Tangerine last night. Tropic Thunder or Tangerine? Tropic Thunder or Tangerine. I watched Tropic Thunder last night. I found it delightful. Good, I'm glad. Yes. Uh, I also... I'm not surprised. Disaster Artist didn't get a lot of nominations. It's not too surprising since Franco may or may not be more of a jerk than we thought he was. I don't know. I'm... Whatever. The, the internet care. will figure you that know, out. It was a fun movie. I really enjoyed it. I'm not sure I felt like it was... Being I mostly just thought Franco was really good in it, but... Ah, uh, don't... We're, don't take the Oscars too seriously. Yeah. Um, let's see. What else? I'm trying to think of what else. I can't think of what else. Other things got nominated. I want to see some of those foreign film nods. I've yes. seen we're one seeing, of them. I've seen two. No, one of them. You've seen one of them. You've seen The Square. I haven't seen The Square. We're hopefully going to be... Uh, <laughs> Logan was nominated for, for Best Adapted Screenplay. Yes, which is a lot considering it's a superhero movie. And it was one of the better movies of the year as far as superhero movies go. And maybe in general? I don't know. I'm not sure where I'd put it. I mean, every year some of my favorites don't get out. It's fine. It's, it's fine. fine. Yeah, it's, it's fine. It's, to me, it's like the, the Super Bowl, except I don't care about the Super Bowl. Yeah. I don't even really care that much about the Oscars, but it's mostly about marketing and it's amusing to see all the categories. The spectacle. I do want to see Loveless and A Fantastic Woman, which are both in the uh, foreign film. I very film. much want to see those as well. The Insult is still playing around here. I don't know if we're going to get to see it or not, since it's not in theater for that much longer. We'll see. Uh, I don't know about the square or the other one, which name, which the name I've forgotten. Hopefully we'll get catch those. Soul something. I don't know. Anyway, not as in Korea, but... Sarah, what are your expectations for Darkest Hour? I feel like it's going to be one of those dour, biopic type films, and that doesn't mean I won't enjoy it. I might like it. It just, every year, you get those, like, here's... Here's a learning opportunity, children. So let's <laughs> let's watch this. Um, I'm sure Gary Oldman will be good. Um, I do like the period, the the time. I mean, it's the same period as Dunkirk. <laughs> yep. So I'm sure it'll be fine. <laughs> uh, How about you? So. I am more into biopics than Sarah is. I'm still not in love with them, per se. Uh, probably, I'm expecting this one to be above average, if not actually that. It looks a little light on story, heavy on character. One can hope uh, that it has more to it than that. And I'm not sure what else I'm expecting from this. I've seen the trailers. It's just a lot of Gary Oldman. It's a little funny going into the movie because I have a couple of friends on Facebook who have been posting things about how Winston Churchill was an awful person to India and other sort of colonial, not Britain areas. Uh, I got you know, colonialism, that bad stuff. So, But this movie is glorifying him, so who knows? I don't know. I'm still curious to see it. It's almost like life is complicated. But I, know. I know. Heaven forbid. Are we going to talk about the movie we're going to oh, see? Oh, yeah. Next? It's, 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 I don't think you can see it. There's too much glare, but hey, look, it's Peter Rabbit. Yeah. We're not seeing we're Peter Rabbit. We're really looking forward to seeing Peter Rabbit at the first chance. That um, is, This is the one with Don Gleeson in it, right? An early February movie, always a good sign. It's Dom our favorite time of year and our favorite. <laughs> uh, Don Gleeson is he's going to be fine. He's set up. Like, I hope he starts investing in real estate. I mean, yeah, he's him and The Rock. I'm, I, I want him and The Rock to be in a movie together. <laughs> totally. Both of them. Totally. All right, on to the movie. 